Hi, I'm Megan and today we will be exploring an Apple creation app called Pages. Pages lets you create stunning documents on a Mac, an iPad, or an iPhone, or on a PC using iWork for iCloud. It is also compatible with the Apple Pencil. Before we get started, don't forget to subscribe to our channel by liking our logo during the video. Also, give us feedback by clicking on the pop-up cards in the upper right-hand corner. To get started with the Apple Pages app, open up the app on your iPad. It will open you up to any recent documents that you may have created in Pages. You can choose to start from a template or from a fresh document. For this first part of the demo, I will start from a template to show you how to use the formatting tools on the top toolbar. After selecting a piece of text, you can tap on the paintbrush and this will allow you to manipulate and to change the text that you have in your document. Notice the different options that you have. The important thing is to make sure that something is selected so that you see your options. You also have a way to customize the toolbar so if things that you use more often you can slide up and, and slide down and order the way that you might use them when you're creating a pages document. Besides formatting the text, you have the option to bring in additional items that you might want to bring into your Apple document. Notice that whatever you select on, you have several options and you'll know that by the scroll bar down at the bottom. Whenever you see that, you'll notice that there's actually more options if you scroll to the left or the right. Tapping on any of these will allow you to bring those items into the document. You can do the same with pictures as well, and it makes it very easy to resize the image and to wrap the text if that is your intention. Now I'll quickly demonstrate how you can instant alpha a picture. So if you have a picture that happens to have a background on it that you would like to remove, like you would like to remove this black background behind this bird, you can do so by selecting the image, going up to your paintbrush, and choosing where it says Instant Alpha. It gives you the instructions to then drag your finger and then let go. Once you choose Done, then it allows you to move that image around and notice that it removed that background for you. Really neat way to get rid of backgrounds. The trick to that is just to make sure that there isn't much debris or much going on in the background of the image. You can find any documents that you created back in your Pages library you also have some options when you go to share or export your document. And doing that by tapping on the three dots, and that will give you your options. You can send it as a mail attachment or even airdrop the Pages document. So again, Pages is an Apple creation app that can be used to create and edit stunning documents when using the iPad, a PC, or iCloud. Thanks again for watching this tutorial about the Apple Creation app, Pages. Be sure to subscribe, like, and follow us by clicking on the links below in the description. Thank you, and see you next time.